My name is Nick Metcalf and welcome to Hometown Hits. Today I'm in Nyack, New York at the Breakfast and Burger Club. Nyack, New York. Just 20 miles north of New York City and sitting on the Hudson River, this quaint village is home to the Breakfast and Burger Club, a diner cooking up some crazy combinations. Before heading into the kitchen, I sat down with a couple of locals to see what this place is really all about. How long have you been coming here for? Two years. Two years. Nice. What's your favorite thing on the menu? So it was a special a couple weeks ago. It's a corn muffin with some bacon and an over easy egg on top of it. Wow, that sounds delicious. Oh, really good. What's your favorite thing on the menu? Uh, definitely the cheeseburger mac and cheese. Nice. Okay, now I'm hungry. With endless options, I pick out three things that I think will satisfy my taste buds. Let's head into the kitchen and see what we're working with here. We got the drooling waffle right here. So we put a couple of pieces with churro bites. Banana pasta right here. Right on top. Oh. Vanilla ice cream. Vanilla ice cream. Walnuts. Ooh. Just to keep our interest. Oh my lord. A Drizzle. Little caramel sauce. You gotta add some extra buff to it. There you go. If you have breakfast in the name, you better have a damn good waffle. I started off here with the Cinnamon Churro Banana Foster Waffle. Yeah, that's an insane combination of flavors, and I never would have thought to put that on a waffle. Those Cinnamon Churro Bites had a great crunch on the outside while still being soft and pillowy on the inside. The ice cream was great. The caramel, the bananas foster. This one was a winner. It's time to kick crazy up a notch with Birria Tacos. What are we working with here? I'm going to do some Birria Taco Pancakes. Birria taco pancakes. That sounds wild. Some cheese on it. So now we're going to do some scrambled. All right. More cheese. And now it's all with tacos. Love it. See the cheese melting? Oh, there? yeah. The pancakes look killer. Birria. Top it out with some onions and cilantro. Here we go. House made consomme with birria pancake tacos. Here we go. I could not believe the size of these things. I swear to God, each one weighed probably about a pound. This place is not shy about their portions. One bite and I was in heaven. The richness of that cheese combined with the savoriness of that birria meat. You have the fluffy eggs with the cheese and the perfectly cooked pancake to hold it all together. Once I tried this house made consomme, I realized I should have been putting it on every single bite. It brought together the entire dish. It's sweet, savory with a little bit of heat, and honestly, I could drink this shit like water. But I couldn't leave the breakfast and burger club without trying an actual burger. Pepper jack cheese. Add some poblano peppers. And add some onion rings. We'll throw some jalapenos in there. And stir it in there. Seal it. That's the ring of fire. Ring of Fire Burger it was, with jalapeno peppers, poblano peppers, buffalo tossed onion rings, and pepper jack cheese. This thing had some heat. But being from Buffalo, New York, I can handle the heat. Here we go. At first I didn't think I was going to be able to get all the flavors in a single bite, but then I remembered, if you try hard enough, you can do anything you put your mind to. The burger was juicy and tender, but the star of the show here are all the different peppers. They had my taste buds doing the macarena. And finally I had to make sure that they passed the french fry test, and they did with flying colors. Speaking of colors, this right here is a purple blueberry milkshake that George brought out for me as a surprise before we did our little interview. And I'll tell you what, I'm glad that he did. It reminded me of a grime shake, but it actually tasted good. So when do you guys open? We open in March 17, 2021. Nice. And in the middle of the pandemic. Wow, how was that? It was kind of difficult in the beginning, but uh, everybody was waiting for us to open. You have a very unique menu. You combined a lot of different flavors. Where do you get your ideas or concepts from? All my concepts I've been building through my experience of being over 20 years on the business. Wow. So I've been working in different states, so I've been creating different foods, mixing different flavors. Plus, my background is Mexican, so I get all the spice from there. What's your favorite thing on the menu? Al Pastor. The Al Pastor meat that we make. That's why I keep adding to any single dish that I make. So add it to an omelet, add it to quesadillas, to wild fries, to a burger. So people can actually have, you know, a chance to try it in any way they can. Nice. All right, well, thank you so much for having me, George. Thank you very much for taking your time, Kyle. Thank you, man. The Breakfast and Burger Club in Nyack, New York is an absolute home run. Know of any hometown hits in your area? Drop a comment and I might just drop by.